And welcome back to Hardcore Minecraft, picking up where I left off last episode. We had, I believe, done a heap of exploration. And now we have some more iron. We have diamonds. I actually found diamonds. And we found everything we really needed to find so early in the game, except, 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 except for somewhere to actually build this log cabin. Because this is a very extensive lush cave, but the problem with it is that it gets to a certain point and then just kind of stops. Um, or not just kind of stops, it doesn't... It doesn't yield any large open areas to build in. I mean, we get bits like this, but we can't really build a, a log cabin in that. What are you? Oh, that's a bat! Oh, I like how they look with this texture pack. Let's go and grab that clay, because we could make plant pots out of that. As our axolotls make happy little axolotl noises. So while our iron smelts, I'm going to expand this. Because I can. Um... That one. What else? Not really any others that I can grow. I can mine out that andesite. So hopefully that being a little bit larger will encourage axolotls to spawn in there too. do is get rid of these torches though I don't want artificial light to make it harder for them to spawn I don't know if that's actually a thing but I'd rather not take the chance what they can have is a spore blossom And there. Okay. Yeah, good episode. See you next time. Um, I don't know what else to do right now. We've got dark oak. We've got diamond. Not enough to make a diamond chest plate, though, yet. I mean, that's really all I can do is gear back up and head down there again. I mean, did we bring the... We brought the obsidian. That's right. We need to find a source of leather um, so I think we're actually gonna have some overworld exploration this episode trying to find a source of leather so that we can build an enchanting table did I have no I don't have feathers yet do I have seeds no I don't have seeds on me either Yay, another chimkin. Well, oh, that's progress in the right direction. That's one C. Can I please have another game? May I trouble you for one more seed kindly? Thank you. That will be two chimkins. Ah, oh, and our 30th level. Uh, well, I don't guess, I don't guess, I don't suppose it really matters when we head off since we're taking our bed with us. I've got plenty of torches, so I'll just leave the lapis behind. We know where our home is here. I've um, got tools. No time to stop procrastinating. This isn't the fear of the dreaded 30th level, is it? Oh, absolutely. It is a well-established rule of Minecraft that once I get to level 30, my death is assured. Well, let's head this direction. I, I know on my way back I'll grab some um, mossy cobblestone. Because I want to use that in the foundation of the log cabin. Oh dear, my nose. Playground. 
especially who sneezes through all your videos. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything. You don't have to. Grab some coal because it's here. Let's go to sleep directly above this source of lava. Do we spawn in it? Do we spawn? Ah. Oh. It does look cool though. We're gonna leave that. Run far, far away from it. I thought that was a village for a moment there. I just saw the layers of podzel on top of the, uh, on the, on the words. On the, the ground as it sloped upwards and thought it looked like a roof. I don't think there are any villages in Mega Tiger biomes though. I mean it would be awesome if there were, just saying. Oh, this could fit the bill. That was a good series, I need to rewatch that. Oh. Yep, we have found where we're layering. Wow. What is that purple up there though? Ah, oh, it's things shooting at me. Multiple things shooting at me with multiple glowing purple tools. And I am here realizing that I am running out of food. Fucking pick a fight with you, mate. Yeah, of course you don't drop your enchanted items. That would be fair. But holy shit. How can I not... This is exactly what I was hoping to find. Just more completely underground. I'll work with this, though. Absolutely. fucking lootly This is stunning. Alright, so... We have an Enderman that I'm desperate to not make eye contact with. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Come here, mate. Yeah, you. You Ender fuck. Come face me in this nice big body of water. I've got 33 pork chops. That sometime is no time soon. Right, where'd you go? Right, those skeletons are more of a concern right now, honestly. dropped a bow at least that's something but there were two of them what happened to number two grab that arrow it looks like the other one got taken out by something what killed the skeleton we have arrows sticking out of our brain oh repairing our bow one shitty spare bow at a time Nope, nope, nope. Right, so Enderman is still there. I need to just get right out though. Before those skeletons take me out. That was close. I fucking see you, you creeper shit.
I need to get right away from all of this. Come here, Enderman. Oh, an enderpearl. That was worth it. I'm just going to put light here. And here, and just kind of light everything up. I've got one, but thank you, honey. I see that horde of skeleton archers. So many of them. I'm gonna have to come back another time. I just can't. There's one, two, there's five that I can see just from here. And one of them is a match right now for us. So we will have to come back another time. We know where we are. I'm just going to step out here where it's nice and sunny, and my only worry will be a creeper. We can just make a note of where we are. Entrance is at 1942. 63. There. Well, we've got an Pearl as a trophy at least from this adventure. Um, time to head back and start gathering resources, I guess, because we'll be coming back here with... Uh, I want to try and get... I want his bow more than anything else there. I want his bow. Did he drop anything? Nope. How am I looking? My armor's seen better days. Fucking creeper again. Yeah, we're gonna have to come back. I don't even. I think I'm. I've got four arrows. I don't know where I got four arrows from, but I've got four arrows. But we are not equipped to to clear that out yet. But we found where we're moving to. So progress. What we need to do though now is grab some of these boulders. That's a nice boulder. <laughs> That's my girl. So I just walked in and heard about the boulders and was like, okay, that's my cue. This is why there's a ring on that hand. Pretty much. So I'd like a stack of mossy cobblestone, I think. Be a good amount to begin with. Probably, probably two stacks of spruce, realistically. Since I'm doing the walls out of logs themselves, that adds up very quickly. You will need a fair amount. Yep. I want that piece too. Yoink. Should have brought more tools with me. I also do think that if we go back to the original lush cave, we will be able to work our way across and find this one. I'd be amazed if they were not linked. I heard you, skeleton.
Where are you? Under us, I assume, since I can now hear him to my left. So we've got a stack of mossy. Oh, I'll finish the second stack then. That ca that happened quicker than I was expecting. That's what she said. Yeah, he's definitely below us. Probably in the lush cave. We've got a nice bank of stone here to quarry from if we ever need just straight up cobblestone too. I appreciate that. That's sunset though. Oh yeah, the sunsets in between the texture pack and the shaders, the sunsets are spectacular. You have to go back to slummy at regular Minecraft with me later. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bedrock will have shaders one day unless you feel like putting Java on your laptop. I should probably sleep though now. up some more of this iron. Seriously Oscar, what is it with every time he records Minecraft you have to fucking stink? <laughs> what is it? Yes, he's totally confined that to me playing Minecraft. No, for every episode you record there's at least two massive stink stink farts. Jesus dog. <laughs> he totally doesn't wait. This is a nice little cove too, just in here. Oh. I should do something with this and turn it into a fishing point or something. That's why I get for giving you a bloody treat earlier. Oh well. You've always right, Pump, you're not in trouble. Yet. He's fine. He's old and flatulent. He's fine. I know you're going to make a comment. I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> what would I have to say on the subject? <laughs> I can't possibly think of how I would respond to a comment about anyone getting old and flatulent, my darling. Watch yourself. I do regularly. The kids keep putting these videos on. <laughs> it's a special kind of hell. Oh, did that perfectly com Oh, I've got two more. You know what, I'm just going to place these two mossy cobblestone blocks back down, rather than have to complete a third stack. Okay, so now we're going to cut down one of these mega spruce trees. Like so. High action gameplay. It's so getting dark enough in here that I should be worrying about creepers. Ah, fuck. This can't go much further up, surely. Holy crap. There we go, that's the top, finally. God, I miss being able to do this in bedrock. It's 
it's probably going to give us a couple of stacks just on its own. over one and a half. Nice. Well, let's do another one of those and that should be plenty. Um, do we have one nearby that we can cut? Oh, right here. Thank you, game. And the joy of it being where it is too, is we've got that lovely big body of water just outside that we can fish in. Without having to go too far at all, whereas where we are right now, we haven't really had any good bodies of water in that cave itself. The only thing I would be minded to do is import a stack or so of clay blocks and place them around, the, around in that so we can also breed axolotls in there. All right, that is two and a half stacks of spruce logs. That should be ample for what we need. Because we're all about sustainability, we will just grab some saplings to replant. Where are we? Here. Like so. I can see you up there. Just hurry up and fall down. Two. Four. There we are. There. And we've got another couple that we can plant anywhere. Like there. Actually, we can plant another mega here. There we are. All right. Not just sustainable, but actually rebuilding the environment faster than the creepers can destroy it. So we also want some dark oak. Dark oak and birch. I actually want birch. Frames. That is, this is not the game to be doing that. I mean, yes, I have a backup of this world, and I will reload it if I die because of bullshit like lag. But it has to be an actual lag death. Like, the game drops out, and then a moment later I come back and I'm just jibbed and there was a creeper or something. I'm sure you're working on it. shitload of iron, throw that copper in there because why not, uh, I need more tools, I love that we're swimming in more iron than we know what to do with now, did I throw my sticks away, I apparently did, so another pick, another shovel, another axe, Make another pick because we go through them pretty quickly. And throw the copper in there. Oh, what am I missing? Feathers. I am missing feathers and a source of leather, that's right, because we need to make an enchanting table still. And one thing I don't have here is. Um, well, cows and or traders. 
Oh, and I've got pins and needles in my leg. I changed while I was sitting. Now I've got the, the pins and needles where you can't move without feeling it. And so the temptation is always there to, to move and make, make it as bad as possible because masochism. Oh, there we go. Oh, instant regret. Oh, it hurts so good. So what am I doing now? I'm tempted to grab my fishing rod actually and see if I can get a decent bow. Because I'm not finding much else here. So we'll, we'll do some fishing. We've got four minutes left in this episode anyway. So I don't know, we'll, we'll fish for the next five, ten minutes. If I can find my way back. Apparently not there. Throw a torch in just to help keep it safe. Where's my bed? I'm still carrying it, good. And I can only be so far from home. I hear my chickens. So we'll go to sleep, we shall fish for a day, and then we shall call it. Now I know I can't fish in these little pools. God damn it. So what we might have to do is um, the next episode or two, hey dolphin, is go adventuring in one of our existing mine shaft and cavey things to find um, some more diamonds, make some better gear before we attempt to claim our land. For the time being, though, fishing is good. Whoops. Can I catch the dolphin? Can we silk touch the dolphin? Hmm. Doesn't sound like the dolphin likes that idea. Probably because he knows it's worth trying. What have I got on this rod? Oh, just unbreaking and mending. No wonder it's not doing too well. I mean, it's never going to die. That's something. God, the shaders really nerf the, uh, the, the, the bubble stream in the water. This is so peaceful. just a bottle of water but something other than fish plus then we get the glass bottle to do other things with whoops that fish just a fish oh 
Oh, a book. Blast Protection 4. Holy crap. It is a good book. And Quick Charge 1, which I have no idea what that is. I think that's a crossbow thing. Happy little dolphin. Name tag of pufferfish. Meh. There's another fish. Well, we tried. Oh, Oscar, no wonder you just ran away. He farted himself away again. That's never not hilarious. I know. Or when he gets air when he does it. <laughs> when it actually starts him so hard that he jumps. Now he'd be used to the idea that he farts. No, no. No, he is a moron. He's our moron, and we love him, but he is inescapably a moron. Yeah, yeah. I, I can't even deny that. He, he's pretty dumb. He's amazing. He's our dog, but he's he's dumb. Like he makes two short planks look like a fucking computer. <laughs> he fits right in. Pretty much. Like we can't be too judgy here. That moment of worry that I may not get another sapling from this tree. There we go. Third to last block, but we got one. Alright, I need to find... Oh, we've got another jungle tree right there, so it didn't even matter. There we go, and more seeds. So that we can continue to breed our chimkins. Yep, that's the pond. I know that yellow axolotl. Right. Two, three, and four. Oakley doakley, I'm going to put that book in there. Acacia saplings, do I not? I didn't bring any birch saplings with me, so we're going to have to go adventuring next time for birch saplings. But that is distinctly next episode's problem at this point. I really don't need one piece of kelp. Uh, hey little guy. Can go in there. Here, you need to go back up there so that you'll be safe. Um, that being said, we're at past half an hour. We've done our fishing. We've found a new lair. We've actually we've ended on a quiet note, but we've still gotten plenty done, exploration and gathering wise. So I'm going to leave it there. And next episode we will resume. I think we'll do another. Uh, above ground adventure looking for leather and birch um, and then we will come back and then probably an episode after that of caving looking for some more diamonds and materials so that we can um, 
prepare ourselves to go and conquer that cave. But until then, cheers.